Usually I'm used to getting flack on Twitter, but this time I was surprised because YouTube hates this protogen. Yesterday, I posted a few pictures showcasing this avatar, which is a new protogen base made by Toastador called the Protonoid. This avatar has been in development for the last few months, with one of the main focuses being on face tracking. That's right, this is one of the first protogen avatars with dedicated face tracking built into the model. Now, I don't have face tracking to show off, but here's a clip of somebody else showing off a little bit of the face tracking and how expressive this avatar can be. However, when I shared those pictures, I was surprised to see the sheer amount of hate that this avatar seemed to get. There were people comparing it to other avatars, to previous avatars that have been uploaded to VRChat, but mostly there was non-constructive criticism about the avatar and the avatar creator. And I don't know about you guys, but I think it's a little silly just to hate an avatar because it's different from what you're used to. There's a lot of great things to love about this avatar. If you're not interested in the face tracking, maybe the armor design is your liking. Maybe you're like me and maybe you wanted a more mature version of the NKD protogen. What I'm saying is there's plenty of valid reasons not to like something or use a particular avatar base. I'm not here to change your mind on that. What I am saying though is it's highly inappropriate to just rag on the avatar or the avatar creator just because this is different. Now, I really like this avatar personally and this is going to be my main avatar for a little bit. I know a lot of people aren't gonna like it, but that's sort of where I'm going with it because it just feels good to use. And at the end of the day, that should be what matters most when you're using any sort of avatar is, do you feel good using it? This model is different from what you're used to. I'll definitely have more videos coming out using this particular avatar. So if you're interested in that, make sure to subscribe. Because honestly, there's a lot of good things to show off about this avatar that I can't fit into a short video like this. When I posted these pictures to YouTube, a lot of the comments I was getting were very empty, unconstructive criticisms about the avatar, how it looks, and non-issues like Uncanny Valley sorts of things, and non-issues as being reasons why people hate the avatar. In my honest opinion, it's not okay to be negative just to be negative towards an avatar. Somebody poured their heart and soul into this, and they worked their ass off to make sure that it was done right. And the quality of the avatar shows not only in the look of the avatar, but the feel of the avatar and the setup of the avatar. Avatar. You shouldn't invalidate somebody's work simply because you don't like the look of the avatar. But I want to know your opinion. What do you think? Are you waiting on a video to come out to make a better judgment? Or are you waiting to see them more often in VR chat? Again, it's perfectly fine if you don't like the avatar. It's going to be your thing or it's not going to be your thing. And I'm not saying that this avatar is better than the NKD protogen or the protodoll or any other protogen that's come out before this. For me personally though, this is the more mature version of the NKD protogen I've been looking for for the last three years, so it's the avatar I plan on using the most. Change isn't a bad thing, and you know what? It's about time I branched out and started using other models. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments, what you think. Try to be constructive, don't just be negative to be negative. And hey, if it's not your thing, it's simply not your thing. However, let's leave the negativity out of it.